Hi, welcome back to the channel. Um, today I have for you, uh, this is the um, Iron Studios for uh, Harry Potter and Buckbeak. Um, the first statues I have gotten were actually from Inesco, but they discontinued their, their line. Um, then I was watching The Potter Addict and uh, I saw this on the shelf. I'm like, oh my gosh, that is this is such a cool piece. I was like, I got to get it. They ran a Black Friday special where it was like free shipping and like like half off. So uh, I ended up getting um, this one here and also got Professor Snape, which we'll, um, we'll unbox that one in a later uh, video. Um, here. So, these pieces are really nice. All right. Okay. There we go. All right. This is a huge box. Okay. The box itself is like really nice. Here's what it looks like. That's a really nice artwork on it. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, this is um I bought this this is a Christmas present I bought for myself. So, I figure I work hard all year, so I try to give myself something nice for Christmas every year. <laughs> Block the whole thing with the styrofoam. Okay, let's see if we can use this here to open it. Okay. I'm have to try to figure out where I'm going to put this next. I'm kind of limited on space. So, what do I do? I'll go out and buy the next thing again. That'll <laughs> work out. I'll find some place to put it that looks nice. Okay, so first, I'm going to start here, this is the base, okay, so this is supposed to be the water, look at that, it's really cool looking, it's like, looks like it's translucent, you can see my, I don't know if you can see it, but like, you can see my hand behind it, it's really cool, and then that says on the back of it, it says Harry Potter and Buckbeak, Iron Studios, Okay, let's see here, I guess next we'll do this piece here, okay, okay. careful with his fingers, there we go, I know by watching the Potter Act, he had some trouble. Um, I think part of Harry's tie broke or something. So I want to be very careful getting this off. The detail on this is really good. I like how they made his cape look like it's like flying back like that. It's really neat. Okay. Oops. See the rest of it? Oh, I see what probably happened there. The the tie is like, it's probably what happened when he took that off. The It's kind of underneath the tie. I think a piece of that broke off for him. Okay. Alright, so looks like it probably goes like this. There's a 
there's a little hole in here that you're going to slide this into. There we go. Okay, so it looks like that. Let me move this here for a second. Put this down here. Okay, so here's that so far. Okay. Look at this facial expression. It's pretty cool. Okay, so then we got his tail. Okay. His tail. And I believe it goes in like this. Okay, like that. All right. And we got two wings yet. Okay. Here is one wing. I'm thinking it might go like this. Let's see here. Just try to be really careful with this. There we go. Slid in there pretty good. Okay. And then the other one's going to go right there. Okay. There we go. Okay, this is a, let me hold it back a little bit so you can see it. It's a good weight to it. Just want to be careful not to drop it. This is what it looks like. I think it looks really good. Uh oh. Didn't break the tail. I got to have that in right. So this would make a great addition to my collection. So that's that's him. Like I said, I have a Professor Snape one I also got for for Christmas too. So uh I have the Nesco one for Professor Snape, and uh, uh, this one's supposed to look a lot like Alan Rickman also, so I'm excited to open that one up too. But yeah, this I think it turned out really good. I really like it. The detail was really good. Like I said, it has a real nice weight to it. So, alright, yeah, that's... So this is uh, Iron Studios, uh, Harry Potter, and Buckbeak. All right, and I'll see you on the next uh, episode, and we'll um, I'll unbox uh, Professor Snape then next. So, here's this. All right, see you next time.